Guys, that is one of the most awesome props I've ever seen. I told you to stay away! Okay guys, in yesterday's video, I asked you to tell me about some more Spirit Halloween animatronics that you wanted me to take a look at. A bunch of you gave some suggestions, so I picked out a few to look at today. And the first one we're going to look at is called the Creepy Rising Doll. This is from 2015. Now, as usual, we are back on the Spirit Halloween wiki page here. And we're going to check this thing out. This says the Creepy Rising Doll was an animatronic sold by Spirit Halloween for the 2015 Halloween season. It resembled a cracked, eerie doll in a crouching position. When activated, it started to rise along with the arms opening. This sounds cool already. The lights for the eyes changed to each voice. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Blue for a child voice and red for a demonic voice. The mouth also moves but apparently just for the demonic voice that's kind of strange but we're going to check this out maybe it's like a conversation thing between the two of them weird all right let's roll on down here take a look at the pictures that thing does look creepy all right let's look at the box first i love to look at the box for these props creepy rising animated doll Light up eyes, moving mouth with sound, doll reveals creepy face and slowly rises up to six feet tall. So she goes from being short to tall and that is pretty creepy. And her arms lift up. I forgot about that part. Uh, let's see. Okay. We got another picture here. Ooh, look at the face. Yeah, look at that thing. <laughs> I love when they have no eyes and all you can see are the lights from inside shining out the eye sockets. All right, let's see what's next here. There's a good picture. Look at that thing. Man, that thing is creepy. And look how the mouth is like giant. It's jagged going back. I can't think of what the girl's name is, but there was a prop just like last year, I think, um, where the girl's whole mouth just flipped open. All right, let's see. There's another good picture. That must be the, when it's six feet tall. That looks so creepy. And what is this here? Okay, there was an ad for it. Look at that. 13% off any single item on Friday the 13th. That's hilarious. All right. Let's go on back to the uh, the page here. And, oh, here's a couple pictures of her set up in the store. That's cool. I just, I love seeing the props set up in the store. Especially because you can see all the cool stuff behind them. All right, that's a better one. That's a little bit clearer there. The other one was a little bit blurry, but it looks like maybe this is when she's extended all the way up. And then this one, yeah. All right, so that's cool. Let's get, we got one more picture here. Ooh, that's pretty creepy. All the lights off. Haunted house behind her, too. All right, let's go back and watch the video here. That's the best part. Creepy rising animated doll. Here we go. Do you want to play with me? Let's play a game. The rules are very simple. Come over here and I'll show you. Don't be afraid. Come a little closer. Oh, no. That's right. Here, let here me we stand go. Up so I can you. see you better. Ah, yes. Whoa. Now Whoa. I can see you. You look good enough to eat. We can Heck play no. hide and seek if you want to. You run, and I'll come find you. I love a good chase. <laughs> ah, yes. Now I can see you. You look good enough to eat. That was awesome whoever suggested that thank you that holy crap that was creepy <laughs> that is like instantly one of my favorites we gotta watch that again that was cool all right let's start back here hello do you want to play with me 
Let's play a game. The rules are very simple. So Come cool. Come here and I'll show you. Don't be afraid. Come a little closer. That's right. Here, let me stand up so I can see you better. Ah, yes. No. Now I can see you. You look good enough to eat. We can play hide and seek if you want to. You run, and I'll come find you. I love a good chase. <laughs> that is so creepy. Ah, yes. Now I can see you. You look good enough to eat. Guys, that is one of the most awesome props I've ever seen. That is scary. Especially that transition from the, the kid's voice to the, the demonic voice. Oh my gosh. I gotta take a break. My heart's pounding. <laughs> All right. Whew. Creepy rising doll. And look at this. I already took a look. And there is one of those on eBay right now, 350 bucks. When I first saw it on there and it was 350 bucks, I'm like, how could that thing possibly be worth it? It is worth it. Oh man, that absolutely blows me away. That was awesome. One of my favorites ever. Thank you so much for suggesting that. Okay, that takes us to the next one, guys. Hungry Harry. Somebody told me to check out Hungry Harry, so we're going to do it. Hungry Harry, also known as the five-foot animated zombie or life-size zombie animatronic sold by Spirit Halloween for the 2005 Halloween season. Resembled a tan-skinned zombie with messy brown hair dressed in a tattered, bloody suit with a red necktie. When activated, the animatronic swayed side to side. All right, that sounds cool. Making grunting noises and yelling brains and hungry. <laughs> That sounds awesome. All right, let's roll down here and take a look. Here's some pictures. Yeah, look at that guy. That is too funny. Look at that face. Look at his eyes. His eyes are all bloodshot. What the heck? He's wearing like a cowboy hat. Oh, Maybe it's more of like a, an Indiana Jones hat. Life-size zombie, five feet. Whoa! He was originally 300 bucks? That was in, what is this, 2005? 300 bucks for a prop in 2005. Holy crap. All right, let's roll on down here. There's more pictures, but I want to see this video. All right, here we go. Hungry Harry, Spirit Halloween. I'm still trying to come down from that creepy rising doll. All right, here we go. There's the brains. I think he was saying more than just brains and hungry, but he was really difficult to understand. That's pretty cool, though. I mean, I kind of wish his mouth moved, because all he does is just kind of wobble back and forth, but it's still pretty cool. I love zombies, and I did look, and there is one available on eBay right now, and he's three hundred and twenty-five bucks. All right, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm, something's gonna have to be really good to beat the first one we watched. So that brings us to the last one we're gonna look at today: the beheaded bride. However, there are two of them. There's a white one, and then there's also like a red one here. This one was from two thousand eight the red one, and the white one was from 2012. Apparently, they're basically the same thing. They're both a bride with, well, a beheaded bride. <laughs> but let's see. 2012, animatronic sold online by Spirit. Um, resembled a woman wearing a white dress, holding her own severed head. The bride moved side to side while blinking as it moved its mouth to several phrases. Okay, and the eyes also light up. So let's look at the other one here. Beheaded Bride, 2008, also known as the Gothic Beheaded Bride. Sold by Spirit Halloween for the 2008 Halloween season. Oh, resembled a woman wearing a Gothic-style gown, holding her own severed head. The bride moved side to side while blinking. 
moves, move it, I can't even talk, moved her mouth to several phrases and the eyes light up. Okay, so it looks like it's basically the same thing, but we're going to watch the video for both of them. So let's roll on down. Let's look at this picture right here. Here's the the, uh, the white dress one with her box. Kind of a blurry picture. But uh, yeah, just a beheaded bride. And then here's her video. Let's do this one first. This is the 2012 white dress. Here we go. I like how the mouth and the eyes move. Okay, again, very, very difficult to understand what she's saying. Um, like I said, you know, when you film these things, you really got to get the camera up there close to hear what they're saying. And I know you want to see the whole body and the whole movement and everything, but um, but yeah, to record what they're saying, it's pretty difficult. So, all right, let's go back to the uh, the red one here from 2008, and we're going to roll down. Ooh, look at this one. All right, so here's the box, and let's look at the head. Look, <laughs> this one is, I don't know if the other one's this detailed, but look at that. Look at the neck where her head has been chopped off. And then there's her head, the bottom of her neck. And there's the face. Looks like her mouth and eyes both move also. So let's go down here and... Okay, so maybe she's also known as Annabelle. I don't know. Let's watch the video. Beheaded Corpse Bride. Here we go. Did she just say, where am I? <laughs> She's pretty cool. I do like the prop. I like how she's holding her head and it's like swinging. It's not just staying in one place. That makes it look much more realistic. That's really cool. And again, in this video, it's really difficult to hear what she's saying. But can you hear that like clicking? That's the sound of her jaw. Some of the animatronics, their jaws are so loud when they're moving. And uh, I experienced that with a couple of them in the stores. Let's listen one more time here. See what I'm talking about. Perfect. Yeah, you hear that? That's the clicking of her jaw. And that actually takes away from the whole prop, like what it's supposed to be doing. Because that, that, it's just so... I don't know, it's like so invasive hearing that plastic just click, click, click. But uh, those are some pretty cool props anyway, though. I gotta say, though, definitely my very, very favorite in this video was that rising creepy doll. That thing blows me away. Definitely gonna buy that one day. All right, guys, that's it for today's video. I'm gonna look through the comments again. Give me um, more suggestions of what you want me to look at, and I will definitely make more videos on these things. Until then, I will see you guys later. Reesey pieces. I told you to stay.